What's going on guys, Demented Muggy here, and today I'm going to be giving you a quick tutorial on the new Biker DLC for GTA 5. Basically, when you buy a clubhouse, you become the president of an MC, and when you are the president of the MC, you can then set different roles to different players in the MC. With these different roles, these players then gain different abilities that they can use in GTA 5. Now, I'm going to be going over which is the best role to have, or which is the best role to be set as. Now, the different roles include Enforcer, Sergeant at Arms, Road Captain and Vice President. Each in their own are pretty good, but Road Captain is probably my favourite. Now, in the background, you can see me playing as the role Captain, and as you can see, I can spawn in the Slam Van. The Slam Van, obviously, just being a car, not actually a bike, is kind of confusing, but technically, not all biker gangs have just bikes, they do have other cars and vehicles that they can use. You can also spawn in a buzzer that unfortunately doesn't have any weapons but does look pretty cool when you're flying in it with your MC. Obviously the other ability that you have is the sort of formation that the only other person in the MC that actually does have this ability is the president and so it makes you kind of better than the rest of the roles and that's basically it for the road captain he also does have one more ability which means that you start a mission up but really the mission isn't really any important so yeah the next one i'm going to be talking about is the vice captain which basically or the vice president sorry the vice president isn't really that good to be honest all you do is just sort of go around and being the vice president just sounds cool because all you get to do is really spawn in uh, ball shark testosterone so i guess you could use it if you were going to start a big mission where players could come and actually harm the bit like you know you and your squad or you and your mc but to be honest it's not really that important so yeah you can just spawn in ball shark testosterone and sort of call out a hit just in case somebody sort of attacked you you could then call out on a hit for you know anybody who needed taking out but instead of obviously mercenaries turning up it would be sort of bikers the next one i'm going to be talking about is the enforcer now the enforcer is the same sort of as the vice president all he's really good for is if you are playing some sort of a bigger mission and you're off your bikes basically instead of bull shark they can spawn in a sort of armor pack kind of thing they basically spawn in a armor piece that you can pick up so that's basically all they can do i mean pretty sure they can also set the bounty things again but you know that's just the same as the vp the next is the sergeant at arms now they can drop ammo but another good thing that they can actually do is drop a molotov cocktail now the molotov cocktail is obviously a really rare, rare weapon and you don't really find it anywhere so to be honest Perhaps being able to spawn in the Molotov, Molotov cocktail is actually a really good ability. So yeah, that's basically all of them. To be honest, Road Captain is the best. I've been Demonic Monkey, guys, and I'll see you in the next one. See ya! Banana.